Okay, my studio partner and I, Phil O'Malley, got together and wrote a book. It's a children's book, all about a little rooster who thinks he makes a sunrise. And then he finds out he doesn't make the sunrise. And of course, he has to go, th go through several trips as a result of his ego being absolutely dashed after he's been bragging on it. Well, I wrote the story and I did the paintings. But Phil put the book together in such a way that children could learn to read using the book. And we took great care in this and enjoyed it thoroughly. Once we had our hands on it, then we began taking it to four and five year olds in daycare centers, uh, preschool, this sort of thing, down in our, in our neighborhood, which is the center part of town. And it's an art and literacy project. We go and we jabber about the book and have a good time and tease each other. It's good for children to see grown-ups tease each other. And then we turn them loose with paint and they can paint anything they want. And sometimes we put them on, on canvases the size of your living room rug, if you can imagine that fun. When we come back to the studio, we have absolutely no fear. The kids aren't afraid of anything. They're fortunately too little to be afraid. When you were, they were six or seven or eight, you know it all sets in. But at that age, they are not afraid. And so I did three paintings. I had a wonderful time, did them all one afternoon, whap, 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 and realized that the proper name was shot my wad once, shot my wad twice, shot my wad a third time. And so this, I think, is shot my wad a third time. It's thanks to the kids. <laughs>